Hi there. This video tutorial is going to let you see how students will log in, what the interface will look like, and how they will access the basic resources. All right, so here we are at the Think Central website. Once students come here, they will put in their username. It will always begin with BPS and then their ID number and then just their ID number. So they will click on login and here's what the user interface looks like. So here you can see it says welcome to the student's name so you can see who's logged in and then they have things to do. So if I click on that they currently have no assignments but when you create and add assignments this is where they will come. And then if I click on my library this is where you will see um, several different resources, all of the products that you added to your class. So here we can see the real world videos, for example, the math on the spot videos. Um, I am sure it will be helpful for your students to access the student edition of their book at home, for example, so they can come right here to this link. Here's the interactive student edition, which is a great learning tool as well as an e-glossary and other resources. So um, that is where, when you added those products to the class, um, that is where those appear. So um, if we click on Think Central, once again, we'll get back to this main screen. So really easy to navigate, very user-friendly. Um, and I think you'll find it to be a really useful tool for your students. So in order to log out of this um, Think Central tool, we'll click on Log Out, and it takes us back to this screen. In the next video and future videos, you will learn more about creating assignments for your students and how they will access and complete those assignments.